Hey, welcome back to my new video, first of all, thanks everybody for supporting me, I really appreciate your comments and messages. It means a lot to me knowing that you enjoy so much my videos. For those of you who are the first time in this channel, please consider subscribing. Anyway, today we'll be creating this. Before we start, I'd like to invite you to support me on Patreon. You can also get access to all my premium content. You can download the full project of the exact animation you have seen in the example, from the link in the description. So let's start. Create a new composition and name it, Slide 1. I'm using the full HD 1080 pixels preset with 30 frames per second and 3 seconds long. Bring your image, or video into the new composition. Click S, to reveal the scale settings. Create a keyframe here, and change the scale values to 110%. Move to 1 second, and change the values back to 100%. Select both keyframes, right click on any of them, and easy ease them. Right click on this layer and pre-compose it. Name the new layer, Image 1. Don't forget to select Move All Attributes into the new composition. Right click in this area, and create a new shape layer. Open its options. Click on Add, then select any kind of shape you would like for your transition. I will use a polystar for this example. Click again on Add, and select Fill from the list. Don't bother to change the fill color, it won't be visible. Select the shape layer, and click S, to open the scale. Create a keyframe here, at 1 second, then increase the scale values, until the shape covers entirely your screen. Move to the beginning of your timeline, and change the values to 0. Select both keyframes, and easy ease them. Then, open the graph editor, and create a curve like this. If you want to add motion blur to your transition, click here, then activate it from here. This is optional, the transition will look great either way. Change the track mat of your image one layer to, alpha mat. We created the basic reveal for our transition. Select both layers, and pre-compose them. Name the new layer, shape transition one. Click Ctrl D two times, to create two copies of this layer. Offset them three frames like this. Then, select the bottom layer, click T to open its opacity settings, and change the opacity value to 35%. Do the same with the second layer, but change its opacity to 70%. Our transition is ready, let's see how it looks. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial on how to create a modern shape transition in After Effects. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button and comment. It would be great to know your opinions about my tutorials. Also, you can make requests for new tutorials, on interesting effects or animations that you would like to learn. See you soon.